like that. Though. It looks uh, fire as fuck though. Like it really not, does. Like, like being here, bro, you gotta leave, bro. Like we we like yeah, aspire yeah, yeah. to go yeah, to yeah, IE. Yeah, we aspire yeah, to go to yeah, LA. Yeah, like yeah. those areas are like San Diego yeah. or Arizona, cause that's where a lot of other people are doing shit. Yeah. Locally, it's it's not really like that, bro. Like right. the scene is small, yeah, yeah, so you kind of get to know everybody as soon as you can. No matter where you're at, you always gotta like step out. Yeah, you, you know that's what I mean? facts, yeah. bro. So that's even why, if you're in LA, like that's yeah, why I'm I'm so I'm coming over here to you guys. Yeah, you yeah, know what yeah. I mean? Like, cause you gotta get out of your like your zone. You, like that. you said yourself, bro. Like IE feels like this like own independent place. How does it feel like when because LA is like right there? Like, do you ever like, you know, like go out to LA or like, or like you know? I bet you guys just like identify as like yo IE. You know, like you guys your own thing. But um, you bounce out of there a lot or no? Yeah, I do. Um, uh, there's people like I I got love for LA like a lot, bro. And then um. A lot of my coming up, I did it all in LA. Like there, um, at that time, there was nothing out here in the IE. Yeah. So I LA, you just that was just like a must. Like you had to, like it was mando mandatory. Yeah, I'm just like confused, bro. Cause like I I got homies that live in LA, bro. I got people. There's a lot of people that move out there too. The fucking you know chase the dream and shit. Yeah. yeah. You know, but like I I don't know if it's the right move now, bro. And that's why we went full balls to the walls here. Cause we're like, just stay where you're at fucking work hard you know try yeah. to push your audience and like yeah. grow but like i don't know if the whole like moving to la getting like yeah. a fucking 1500 apartment or uh, you know a month and like trying to figure it out i don't know if that's the formula anymore not yeah. anymore yeah. i think like um, if someone yeah. can so? do that i i think if someone can do that that's good for them you know like yeah, but it's yeah. also what you do too i mean i feel like it i i, I think uh you guys staying here it's really smart because like how you said you guys only have big festivals here yeah the people are gonna be the people that are gonna be your guests. They're not gonna be like locals. They're gonna probably be some big ass artists because you guys are the only podcast out here. Low key. Low key. Think about that. It's like a desert, yeah. and then there's just us. <laughs> <laughs> and you guys got the whole look, bro. People are gonna wanna like like. How does it look when you come out here, dog? Are you like fascinated by the mountains and shit, the palm trees and everything? Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I fuck yeah. with the desert, and then how he mentioned earlier about um. The architecture, would you yeah, say? The architecture, yeah, the architecture. Yeah, you guys got some sick you got ass, big architecture. Yeah. You guys got here. um, like mid-century. Mid, mid century. Fuck yeah, yeah, bro. I fuck with that <laughs> shit, bro. Like a lot. Yeah. So it looks. It's, I feel yeah. like I became numb to that shit. <laughs> yeah. I was like, you know what? I know. I could imagine. Yeah. Like we grew up here. Hey, it's like real, from right but real anyway, shit. Yeah. We don't live on the like. We live like as far away from Palm Springs. Like I'm trying to move that way, that too, bro. bro. Like, like we live. In I'm the trying to move to the rich here. fucking like neighborhoods. Like yeah. I'm trying to walk yeah. my dog and not. You know, you know what's <laughs> crazy? My homie Michael, shout out Michael, is security guard. He just told me that he met because he he works in those mansions and shit. Yeah. He just met Travis Barker and and Kourtney Kardashian at the yeah. front gate. They have houses here in PS. Yeah, Justin Bieber has a crib out here. What did he say? Uh, he said they were just checking in. He was work he was working the front gate, and he said they were really nice and they were cool. And they greeted him, and they're like, "Oh, we're back." Oh, that fool has like piercing eyes, bro. Travis Barker, like, like I feel like he could like stare through your fucking soul, dog. Yeah, just like fuck yeah, he's he a, fucking a fucking legend, dog. Courtney Kardashian, he's a fucking legend. Jeez, I mean, he just told me that. I thought that was sick. Yeah, there's a lot of fucking people that come out here and shit. The fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> Did Broly go Super Saiyan on me? What the fuck? Broly just went Super Saiyan for like two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's going on about that? Nothing, bro. So, how's yeah. your day going, bro? How about that? Um, so far, the drive was pretty lit. Like, I saw the. How far was it done? Um, hours. Like an hour and ten. Oh, okay. okay. Not bad, yeah. bro. Not bad. You drive a lot. You said you drive. I drive to OC every day, and I'm in Riverside. That's an. Uh, that's another hour and ten. Maybe sometimes two hours. Yeah. But it's worth it because um, there's a lot of opportunity right there at that job where I'm at right now. Um, and he hooks it up with like. I got all the resources to myself. Like anything that he has, he just like. Oh, that's the best. Bro. And then he fucks with me heavy. Um, uh, I work at Fashion Rock. Uh, shout out to Fashion Rock because they've been helping me out a lot. Um, but yeah, like I'll just tell I'll just tell my boss like, hey, like I'm trying to come out with this. I'm trying to come out with this. Like, what do you think? And then he'll charge me just for like the blank or something. Like he won't even charge me for the work of like pressing it or screen oh, printing dope, it. Bro. He's fire as fuck. Shout yeah. out Sean from that's Fashion sick. Rock, man. Wait, wait, wait. How do you feel? Because I did a separate video on this, bro, where I went fucking in. I was kind of just trashing on all these fucking, you know, little clothing brands, which is a little right. fucking low of me, dog. I'm not going to lie. I'm just a little <laughs> it's fucking, okay, bro. But, 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 but here's is my question was like, how do you feel about like the state of like, like that right now, bro? Like, like clothing, fashion, streetwear? Because it's a weird state, bro. We just came out of like, it felt like the supreme era and like hype culture to like that mid point where it was like, okay, now people are being independent, starting their own companies. And then now it's like oversaturation. But like, how do you feel about it now? Um, 
I kind of like with everything. I kind of like oversaturation because yeah. what that means is like there's money. Mm. Like, you just gotta be fine, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's up to you to be fine. You know what I mean? Like, and I know guys like you, like you guys, like. I mean, I the, the way I tell people is like, you shopped your whole life, so yeah. you know what to expect. Like, you know what a brand is. Like, everybody has like this knowledge in their head. They don't realize it though. Like, they just shop like without thinking. And like, as long as you like know how to stick out, or like as long as you as long as you think it's fire, like a lot of people are gonna think it's fire. So, I mean, it's the same thing as like music. You could say the same thing. It's oversaturated, but yeah. at the same time, like there's way more opportunities for other artists. Like, I feel like like let's say you go back, like, there was less opportunities for people, oh fuck yeah for bro, people to nothing. go go up right. But nowadays, it's like you could partner up with like someone local and like they'll. They have more of an open mind because I come from back in the day where like I would ask people like, hey, can I shoot a music video in your liquor store? I'll, yeah. I'll pay you. And they'll be like, nah, yeah. like they're not in. They don't want to look bad or nothing like that. And nowadays, like they might even do it for free if you shout them out on. Oh, for you know real? I mean? So <laughs> true. Hey, I've seen yeah. that shit. Bro. Like yeah. oversaturation is always good. <clears throat> That's true. Always, bro. bro. Like, that, always. that was my biggest thing, too, because I was like oversaturation. Yes, it might be bad, but <laughs> competition, it, it allows for people to like compete and like really show like yeah. who does great quality work yeah. um you know they're like if you have quality work you'll have a customer mm -hmm. there's always somebody out there that will like your shit if you mm -hmm. do you know genuine Facts. good good work but yeah, yeah. um yeah i just sometimes think about shit too deeply and i just start fucking rambling but that's kind of just the premise of this podcast i mean um i feel like since you got the vision and stuff like that you kind of bro like, speaking japanese it. yeah bro I, i'll go too deep into this shit bro and sometimes i gotta fucking chill dog <laughs> Yeah, no, you don't. Like, you you never gotta chill, bro. All right, I'm not never. gonna chill then. No, but no chill. 2024, bro. No one's no chilling. Chill. I like Fuck that, no, dog. bro. We, we we go we going up 2024. For real, dog. For real, for real. Hey, we said that long. Francisco. Oh, my friends are dead. Yeah, put them in the coffin. <laughs> you want the cold? That's the mood I'm hey, on. This 2024, dog. Cardi is setting the tone. The tone for 2024, right? bro. The tone was like, if you didn't work last year, 2023 for 2024, it's like you're already late. How do you feel about 2023, bro? I feel like the whole consensus on it. I don't know. Some people might have had a good year, but I feel like it was like a working year for, I fucking for hated everybody, 2023, right? 2023, bro. Yeah. What about you? It was like a, a crazy ass, like it was good, but it was bad. You know, like ups and downs yeah. and shit like that. But it, <laughs> yeah. I agree with what you said. It was a working year because uh, 2023 was when I was working on both of these things behind the scene. Yeah. And this year is like when I'm popping it out. Like that's how Actually, we were good, with the podcast. We were trying to figure it out. Yeah. And now we kind of know what we're kind of doing really. I told yeah. him, and that's the biggest thing too, is like a lot of the times you're so immersed, but you gotta, you gotta just realize a year from now, whatever, you're going to look back and be like, there's so much progress. Like just keep on going. 2020 year, 2023 was like a foundation year for me too. Exactly. Dog. Yeah. It, it, was, it was setting up shit because it, it does feel like, I don't know if it's just the number dog, like 20, I don't know, but I don't, like, I don't like it odds. just feels, like odd yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up with the odd numbers? <laughs> I don't numbers, like odd dog? numbers. I like it 24. just feels good, bro. Like 24 yeah. sounds like, you know, is it, is it it's Kobe's, Kobe's year? It's Kobe's year. Kobe's it's, it's Kobe's year. It's Kobe's year. It's 24K year. Like, yes, sir. Yeah, bro, it just what feels. Up? I'm so hyped, bro. Uh, um, I've asked them, bro, but like, what are you excited, dog, for like this new future, like new goals, like new experiences, like anything on top of your dome that you just like want to fulfill this year? Um, yeah, um, it's basically like my brands and stuff like that. But it's crazy because everything lines up because, uh, I got this job like the end of 2023. Mm -hmm. Uh, so now I have all these resources to do everything that I was thinking of. Like it's just right in front of me, bro. I got a I got a building that has a heat presser. I got a building that has the screen printers. I got a building that has the sublimation printers. That's great. Everything that's to the my craziest hand. fucking. I got thing, resources bro. to uh, seamstresses. Um, Fuck. I got everything, bro. Like so, that's what I'm looking forward to. I feel like I worked hard, and then like God kind of like rewarded me, and then like now it's just like I'm gonna have fun this year. Yeah, I think about the shit too. It's like sometimes like when you're in the muck, it's like. Like, or just like experiencing shit, you're like, I don't know where there's this is leading. And then, like, once you kind of get to the end of the rainbow, you're like, oh, okay, I see where the fuck you're this took like, oh, right. this shit, right. you know, bro. Like, I got it. Like, <laughs> greatest example, I got into a fucking car accident, dog, but the, that end of the rainbow's coming in, dog, and that fat shit. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no, you facts, know what, I'm For, uh, yeah. what is it? What did they say? God like, is setting me up. No, facts. Like, trust the process. Trust yeah, the process, yeah, yeah. bro. Yeah. Like, hey, let God cook. Yeah. <laughs> for real, <laughs> for real. <Let> <laughs>
Let him Low cook. Key, bro. Let him cook, bro. The food, God's just like this in the corner. Dude. Yeah, he's cooking. <laughs> Twenty twenty four. Yeah, I, I feel like, like it's gonna be a great year for everybody. Hopefully, yeah. you were oh, else off working. camera. We're talking about music and shit, dog. Like you guys were talking about fucking um, name the names. Young bro, like little Tracy. Tracy. We're just talking about bro. like old underground shit. Yeah. What, the what's the state of music right now, bro? Like, um, anybody that you're excited and looking in right now? Because we're always talking about like Nets bang, like Haunted Mound. You oh, guys are. You guys are. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, wait, who's new? Oh, Lefty Gunplay. I was like, <laughs> oh, no, I mean, he is. Yeah, he is. Hey, I, f- I fuck with the Cholo hey, rappers. But yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, Lefty's hard. I fuck with him. Oh, Lefty is hard, bro. Chino the P. Oh, yeah. Is that from coming up? Yeah, he's cool. Okay, bro, I'm, I keep cool. up with all them cheesemates and all that. Like all the beefs and all that. I watch <laughs> all the podcasts, everything, bro. Yeah. Loki, that's me, dog. Yeah. <laughs> half, you have to. Um, but yeah, uh, you got you guys know about Bear, uh, Bear Wan Boss. He's a pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, he's a Bear Boss, the guy that was in uh, the Joe at the party. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. He's yeah, an underground yeah. rapper. I didn't listen Atlanta. to his music. Is he good? He's fire as fuck. It's oh, new ass sound. Is bro. he from um like New York East Coast? Atlanta. Atlanta. Oh, Atlanta. Okay. ATL. Um, I feel like people like a lot of people already copied his sound. So if you hear mm. him. Like, oh, like, it probably doesn't sound like that new. But just know he was, like, the first one, like, he'd he, he be putting, like, the Super Mario noises, like, all these <laughs> crazy-ass effects. Like, it's fire, bro. And then I found out about him because uh, there's this guy I work with. His name's Jack Wolf. Shout out to Jack Wolf because he's the one who ch- introduced me to Bear. Um, but, yeah, they're both fine. Jack Wolf. Uh, we're going to come out with some stuff, too. Uh, merge. So you've met him? Uh, Bear just, uh I haven't met Bear, no. But, um. Uh, I talked to him through like Jack. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, you ever heard of a guy named a- Xavier So Based? <laughs> uh, recently, I, I have been hearing about him, but I haven't heard like the music. I yeah. I, 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 I know what up. he looks like. He, you guys were playing his yeah, video, yeah. right? I know. Yeah. 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 yeah I f- honestly, I fuck with those kids. Like, right. I, I think. Yeah, it's, bro. <laughs> you can't you, you can't hate on the new gen because they be hustling. Yeah. I want to show you They're this photo. Shit. There's a. Uh, and honestly, it's kind of like it kind of reminds me of like the early days of like. You know, Uno, Cardi, and shit like all oh, these yeah. young. That whole Atlanta scene. Everybody was yeah, like everybody was young as fuck. The golden point. era. Yeah. Okay, yeah, funny uh, when they were Savage. all getting along. Like for real, yeah. huh? Because honestly, this era, like it's cool, but like we know, like as as people grow up and shit, it always you know stems out. It says when I'm in a dick writing competition with an Xavier so based fan, and it's Squidward yeah. like, huh? <laughs> That's funny, dude. <laughs> what do you got to say about that, callers? God damn it. I mean, I'm not a dick writer, but I fuck with the underground and the new gen of kids. Like, yeah, I like yeah. what they're doing, honestly. Like, no like bro, I don't know if you've seen, but they do a crazy. They're supposed to have a show in New York. Crazy line. It was crazy, bro. They like they like ran into the, they like ran to the venue. They like uh, what do you call it? like smashed the metal detectors. Like it was crazy. They shut wow. down the show. They didn't even get to play. So these motherfuckers brought out some speakers and did like a a show just outside like in New York bro like on top of like I don't know what it was a little stage or car or something yeah. and you just had a group like a fuckload of kids bro around like surrounding it was the Damn. most like DIY super punk shit but it was just underground rap That's I'll fine. show you it bro fine. and that shit will like change your perspective it sounds like, like it sounds like Jake and like the fucking um like Young Weege and the bro, the, that's you the know kinda, era. Yeah, that's the kind of like it influence feels I like see. that, bro. Young yeah. Weege is fire, so. low key. I forgot what happened, to them, but I gotta show you guys that shit because it is pretty crazy, honestly. Like the amount of kids that are showing out for that shit, yeah, they're doing it, and they got their little clicks and shit. You know, it fascinates me. It's like, <clears throat> how do people find out about these fucking kids? Like, it's the thing is they have a good formula. Like they have like you know, there's people that are kind of on already, mm-hmm. and then the, they're fucking with other people, and they're putting these artists on too, and they're just all grouping together so everybody like grows together. Mm-hmm. That's the thing, bro. Is like people don't really know that shit. Is like if you look at anybody that's really successful coming up, there's always a team, bro. Always a team. You think of, I don't even know, like you, you know, Ian Connor, Crash Cardi, like ASAP, that whole little clique. You know, you have AWG, all them. You got a like Goth Boy clique, like. Every you know, uh, members only, like all these successful like people that went up, bro, is because it's like a team. But the same thing when you have a team, it's like you have to help each other. Everybody has to help each other. Yes, yeah. bro. Yeah. Everybody has to, you know, everybody's promoting each other. Everybody's helping each other go up. Yeah. And that's how that shit works, bro. Is there a you. team that you, that like in music or fashion that you think is successful that actually did that the correct way? In fashion? Yeah. Or music. Okay. A team of collectives? Yeah, I think like um, members only did it correct. I think like GBC did it correct back in the day. Nah, now they all they all na- fucking nowadays on drugs and shit, and they they well, fucked that's it up. That's the thing. And honestly, with teams, it's like only some of them are gonna get you know. That's that what I'm saying. Is there, is there a, a successful one that's still around? Would you say 
Fuck. Still around? Wu-Tang. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's that's they all fight. I don't know, bro. For real. Still around? Not that I think on top of my head. Foo no. Fighters. Yeah, yeah. For real. That's the, thing, uh, that's the thing, too, is Green Day. Everybody gets to a certain point where yeah. everybody's going to do their own shit, you know? But I yeah. think it's the team aspect of everybody getting there. Maybe City Morgue, but they're splitting, dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's right. what I'm saying, but everything works, bro. Every team, you know, they get yeah. to that certain point, point and, and everybody does their own shit, yeah. bro. They get to a point and then they all start beefing. Yeah. Hey, wait, hey, you know why? Because they hate sharing the bag, dog. Yeah. They hate sharing the that bag, The bag gets bro. so big that they don't want to yeah. split it. But Imagine just, you're in a band, bro. You got eight heads. You got to share that bag. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Well, no, dog. Everybody, I, 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 it's normal, bro. Everybody has We're their fighting. own adventures. You're in, like, a, you're in GBC. There's eight members. You got to split the bag. Oh, fuck. You got to fight for the bag. And the thing is, like, some of them are going to, you know, Pop out more than others, yeah. you know. You had Lil Peep and Lil Tracy, but it's mm -hmm. like everybody has their, you know, remembers only. You had X and like Ski and like, yes, there's other members and they're doing their own thing. Yeah. Everybody just can't be at the same level as everybody. Yeah. But regardless, I feel like everybody can get to the top and you guys can all eat basically. What's that one guy that uh did a show with Israel? Like uh he's he was part of GBC, like the, the early DJ or like Oh, you're talking about um what's his name? The LA show, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, tattooed white boy. He opened he was a closer, right? Like he was yeah. the main, the main, yeah, the was, main line, or the main performer. He was the headliner. Headliner. Um, there you go. Damn, I can't think of his name right now. Anyways, I was just, I was just gonna that. say like he. That's another person too that kind of did his own shit and like he's doing a good shit. I mean, he's bro, selling he's in, tickets. Yeah, he's, he's in schema posse. Like we're gonna, you know. Yeah. We can't look up the flyer. It's gonna fucking bother me that we're not saying. I, know, his I can't name. think. Of, I want to say something about, with a G. He's he is from GBC though, right? Yeah. Add him. No, no, no. He was in schema posse like early on. What's his name? I can't think of his name. Ghost main. No, nah, just kidding. Ghostman's hard, dog. Fucking <laughs> Ghostman. Ghostman's hard. That dude's like a European legend, dude. They love him out there. Dude, you know, I okay, I just thought of a successful group. I would say Suicide Boys. Right. Oh, yes. Yeah, still yeah, doing yeah. it. They're still, still going hard. Yeah. They're still and they're still collective. friends. They're still yeah. friends. They haven't yeah. beefed. Like, they're, yeah. they're, they look pretty healthy yeah. and stuff. So, Max, oh, yeah. another, another one is um, Puyo's Click. They're still oh, yeah, doing yeah. it. Oh, what's his name? Puyo, oh, like, Fat Nick. And, yeah, they're still doing it. Loki Fanek is still running it, which uh, and they I, brought I in a new guy. Um, one of my homies, Tommy homie Killswitch, he's a part of their shit too, and he's yeah, been he was at, Ooh, that's he was his name, is it? Oh no, 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 no he was in no. a, he was in Mo Killswitch. Yeah. He was part of Mo. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he, they're from he's from Florida. I'm pretty sure. He could have uh, been in Mo or either that or Kill Station. I I probably getting them confused. Oh yeah, Kill Station. Kill Station. Yeah, okay, I got them confused. Yeah, Killswitch is on. Oh, they're still doing. I got a homie dog that he's from Edinburgh, Texas. Right, he's a fucking savage. He runs Psych Ward. He did uh like oh, fatness. Fuck that. Yeah, he did Fat Nick's fucking artwork for his album. He did a yeah. couple. I think he's doing his merchandise as well. That was fucking crazy, dog. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I think I'm interviewing him next week. Online or dude, the thing with Israel, person? bro, is like this is a slideshow, dog. I can't fucking even. I can't okay, think of that cool. dude's name for some reason. Yeah, whatever. Shout yeah, out to you, good. bro. <laughs> you headline for the homies. He's so. a goth. He's a goth boy, bro. He's all tatted up. Fucking. He wasn't right. a GBC though. He was in scheme. No, no, no. I'm just saying he looks like a goth boy. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, he's definitely got his shit going. Same shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Same shit. They're all yeah, friends. The, the gal the shit's cool, bro. They're probably all friends. Nah, low-key. Everybody knows each other. So music is heading. Do you like do you fuck with uh Cemetery and Haunted Mountain? Uh I'm I'm not I know what they look like, but I'm not too familiar with like what yeah, I do not he's not hip. That shit. <laughs> what are you listening to like right now? What are yeah, um, that's bro, a good question. I've been having the all the it's the new car, bro. I've been having it on repeat, okay. bro. What? Yeah, no. 2024? Wait, wait, wait. Give me your, give me your, your in the row one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> of, wait, it says wait. a lot about you. <laughs> the, the, the last What's your number one that just came out? You have like hood by air. I already know what you guys are doing. No, 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 no. You guys think I'm going to say 2024 is for at number one? No, fuck no, no, no. no, 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 no. I don't even think it's so The best one is the last one he popped out with, uh, Evil Cardi or Evil whatever. Jordan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the second best one is, uh, no, no. Uh, yeah, back rooms number two, and then number three is the other one where he's uh just where he, he said the line. He's like, "All my homies are dead." Oh, yeah, Put him in oh, the oh, that's number hood three, and then twenty twenty four is like that, that, it's not even saying that it's not fire. It's just so fire. It's just that he kept putting, he kept stepping yeah, up the bar, yeah. bro. <laughs> Every and then he needs to stick to his new voice. Like it, Fuck. the deep voice shit. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. He yeah, sounded yeah. he, he, he like he grew up or something. <laughs> <laughs> like he's on his man shit now. Yeah, for real. No, Dude, but that I, sounds like future dog. Or I some fuck shit, with bro. all the Cardi, like all eras of Cardi, bro. I, yeah, I think this is the best one. I've been bro. fucking with him since he had like a little bit of plays, bro. I, I know ass. some old ass songs. Like I don't know if you guys ever heard this song called PlayStation by Cardi, but he just sampled the PlayStation. Yeah, that shit. That, yeah, like yeah. the boot up. Yeah, that's tight. No, I think that's a solid. That, I would say my list would be pretty similar to yours. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It is true that you said though that like, bro, 
it's not that they were bad. He just kept on going, yeah. bro. Like, it's like, dude, like, give us a break, dog. Like, they're this is too not, good, dog. Yeah. Keep them coming. Keep, <laughs> keep them coming. They're all different vibes, too. Like, You're the Moon is like his normal voice. Oh, You're the, the, the Moon. Part, that one's fire. Like, floaty. Bro, that one was and He got 2024, bad. which is, it seems good, more of like a, a, you I, know, like an anthem. I'd put that one on a separate list. Like, that For one's like, real, when you're dog. like, feeling yourself and you're yeah. just driving down the freeway or something. Every day. Every day. Do, do, do. Hell yeah. Every day. See ya. I see ya. Oh yeah, I, I just be right. smiling this hard asleep, and I don't just be glazing, bro. I think bro is just really like, just bro. That's another shit. shit I'm gonna make glazing. I hope he yeah. drops <laughs> that song with that one beat, bro. That one crazy beat. Yeah, oh, I know what happened. The sure beat or whatever. Yeah, I'm telling you, because like if he drops something like dude, that and it's dude. it's cool and it, he's he got on a beat like that, it's gonna show people that you can have fun with this music shit and just like not really take it too serious, bro. Like just have fun. I'm gonna go off that dude. <laughs> he okay. He's what gonna be gonna like Cardi's homie. Cardi's about to fucking drop that one dude that that he always uses yeah. on his story. Cardi's dropping tonight. You're gonna see Chris doing. Hey, that I shit. like that guy, bro. <laughs> I, I want. Yeah, I need that guy. Bro. That's me, bro. That's, like, <laughs> that's just cool. I'm like, fuck yeah, bro. When I'm alone, bro, I'm like I can hear Cardi right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's talking to me. I'm dead. That's, well, <laughs> just talking to you in your sleep and like, shit. What'd you say? Yeah. See ya. <laughs> like, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> Some people hear their subconscious. This guy here is Cardi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hell yeah, bro. I just be smiling his eyes. <laughs> Fuck, yeah, that sounds scary. Man, that's funny, dog. All right. Well, yeah, I'm just going to cut it right there, dude. Uh, this is the morning show. I had a great fucking morning. And honestly, after yesterday, dude, we got fucking turned. I don't yeah. know if we're going to be able to pull it off today. I thought it was going to be a little fucking uh, atrocious. It's not a but busy day. It's not over. It's yeah, not over. The day just started. Hey, cutting. Music, yeah, the day hey started. What, what music video are you shooting? Uh, when the world comes falling down. Okay, I like that. We're almost done with it. Gotta go to LA shoot the rest. Yeah. Man. Shout out to Los Angeles. Shout and the IE. IE bro. The IE. Don't ever the disrespect IE. the IE, dog. What's the name that IE has that we don't know? Like the nickname for the IE? Insane Empire. Ooh. Oh. And okay. I, I'm not gonna lie. I got a clothing brand called that, but right now it's it's on pause. But okay. I, I, I've i dropped some Insane Empire stuff. You know, hey, that's you know. a fire. That, that kind of reminds me of like World Industries, like Insane Empire. That shit sounds yeah. like, it's like a skate then, brand or some shit. And then shit, Sa- San Bernardino, they call it the Dirty Dino. Yeah. All right. Or, 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 uh, or, wait, what is it like? Murder, murder, Marino Valley, Murder Valley. Murder yeah. Valley. No, but isn't there one for San Bernardino? It's like San Murder. Or- yeah, they say oh, yeah, that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. the more, like, if you show up to San Bernardino and you say the Dirty Dino, you're going to look like you've been living there. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. I thank you for letting me know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm going there and saying Dirty Dino. <laughs> yeah. We love it. Fuck it. We gotta, All right. We got to do an SB tour. Are you down, bro? Are you down yeah, to fucking bro. guide us, dog? Down well, guide us I'll take it. I need you to be our fucking like Mexican tour guide, yeah, dog. Yeah, 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 bro. Just like fucking take it around everywhere and just fucking like. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna go in George we're gonna, sandals we're gonna, and fucking. We're gonna check in with him. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we're checking in with my boy Chris. <laughs> check in with Fi. Uh, <laughs> check in with Fi, dog. Don't, yeah. yeah. All right, people. Thank you so much for being here, viewing, subscribing, liking, commenting. We love you as usual. Make sure you fucking do that shit. Um, and remember, we have Patreon for five dollars a month. Check that out as well. You see this type of shit? You like this shit? You like? It? Well, there's more shit. Oh, you like that? Oh, you Different like that? day. There's more shit on Patreon for you. I just be this hard sleep. Shit. She never made it hard for me. Miss that song. Hey, he thought it was Cardi. What you say? She's in the heat. Tell me why. And for what? I always prepare, cause I never know what.